Morning! Hope you're doing really, really well. I am very, very excited to be away from rainy England for a couple of days. I am in Spain near Javea, Javea. It's basically near Alicante, Valencia, Denia, Calpe, the place where lots of pro cyclists come to train. And I'm here because I'm doing a photo shoot with my sponsors, Smith Helmets. So it's not just me on this shoot, it's me and the legend that is Greg Van Avermaet. We're going to be riding gravel, we're going to be riding road, we're going to be riding in the sun. So that's exciting enough. So I'm going to build my bike on this beautiful terrace overlooking the pool and then let's hit the trails. Sweating, not used to this at all. Oh, so happy to be out of the miserable rain for a bit. Swear to God, every winter I wonder why I live in England. Oh, here comes Greg. Okay, we've got GVA, we've got an amazing view down to the sea and behind me loads of gravel trails, which is where we're gonna go and start doing this shoot. I am just so excited to not be in the rain. I swear to God, I would be the fittest ever, ever, ever. If I lived somewhere like this, it, I'd be unstoppable. I'd be running the whole time, riding in the sea. I just, I have been finding it hard to motivate myself this winter in England. It's been dire. And now I'm here, I am so energized. So hopefully I can bring some of this energy home with me. Nice to be riding my bike in the sun. Right? <laughs> yep. <laughs> so we are shooting some gravel stuff where you have to go. <laughs> Sorry, are you do trying to do something? No, it's funny. I <laughs> <laughs> I'm being laughed at as I'm vlogging. Thank you, Franz. Um, so we're just shooting some gravel stuff here where obviously we are riding, but there's a lot of backwards and forwards. You have to ride up and down the same hill again and again and again and again, doing multiple angles, doing drone stuff, doing slow-mo stuff with the Ronin rig on the backpack. Um, and we've got a couple of different locations, one that's kind of white gravel and then this lovely red gravel that we're shooting on. After that, we're heading down to the beach where there's a lovely bar, I've been told by Greg, and I think we're gonna do some road stuff. <laughs> Nice. How bloody nice. I'm in love with this place, I can't tear myself away, but we have got work to do. Although it is pretty fun work, riding up and down hills with Greg. I mean, this is a good trip. Thank you, Smith. switch to road bikes now and we are riding up and down this lovely lovely loop um quite tiring because obviously um greg's just sort of 
pottering up finding it all very easy and uh, I'm having to put out quite a lot of power for me to stay with him so my little legs are tired I was hoping to go for um, a run later today because I've entered a half marathon and also just because I like running but uh, we'll see that might not be on the cards last couple of shots of the day I am uh, Backward. Wow. Ooh. See you later. Yeah, thank you for the day. And we are done. Greg is going to ride home. I'm wimping out. I'm getting in the car. And then it is Cerveza and Paella time. Morning lovely people, it is the second day of my shoot here in Costa Blanca in Spain. So yesterday we finished up with some beautiful shots, I mean I've seen them. They were flying a drone up above Javea and the clouds were sunk beneath us so you could look out over the town and they were kind of hanging down below us with this absolutely amazing road running through the middle just above the clouds, I mean it was beautiful. I've seen the shots from the drone and they are incredible. I can't wait to see the video that Smith put together. It's gonna to look amazing. So after we finished, we went out for some paella in the town overlooking the bay at this restaurant that Greg suggested. And I thought to myself, I really should talk to him more for the video because he's a legend, he's won the Olympics and he's such a nice guy. So when we weren't filming, obviously him and I were chatting. Um, it's not like we weren't talking, we were talking all the time, but I just didn't feel totally comfortable shoving my camera in his face and chatting to him on camera. And I quite regret that now because today he's not feeling so well, so I don't think he's coming. So sorry everyone that wanted me to actually talk to Greg. I did, I just didn't film it. So today we're heading up somewhere. Very informative, I know. We're heading somewhere. I'm gonna be riding a road bike that they've hired me because I wasn't able to bring mine. A road bike and then my gravel bike. And then later on, some more people are joining us. So I should be able to show you some more of the lovely gravel roads around here, some beautiful views and stuff like that. And just give you a flavor of what it is I do when I'm out here working with one of my sponsors. So yeah, let's go. All right, here's my room, by the way. I wanted to show you this because look, there's a fireplace at the foot of the bed, which is so cozy in the evening. Anyway, let's go ride bikes. I love my family, but <laughs> I'm not super keen to leave behind the sun. It's been a wonderful couple of days. At least I've got one more day of riding. All right, so we're at our first location. We got a car full of helmets and stuff apparently loads of which I'm going to get to take home so that's pretty cool and we are going to shoot some climbs on this road up to Val Debo which is beautiful we've seen lots of cyclists going past the road is smooth it's quiet it even smells nice it's just really nice here so um, I think we're going to do some shots off the bike with the photochromatic lenses and then start cycling and have some fun Oh, first thing I wanted to show you was I was just rummaging, rummaging in the bag of tricks. I found this amazing pair of glasses. I wonder if they'll let me keep it. I'm going to show you. Let me know what you think. How about these? What do you think? Nice? I love them. Fingers crossed. I get to go home with them. <laughs> like the two fingers, the thumb and... Okay, so nice! <laughs> Ooh, gotta love this dream job! Okay, so we are done shooting up here. I stopped filming it all because honestly you don't want to see me ride up and down and up and down and up and down and up and down a hill. I'll show you my Strava, it looks very strange. But now I get to ride my bike down the hill, not filming, just down the hill to go to a bar. Okay, let's do this. Obviously it would be slightly better if I was on a road bike with slicks rather than on 44C tyres with tread, but whatever, let's go!
I am so hungry. It's four o'clock and we've not eaten anything. Well, actually, Haribo. So, oh man, need some food. And coffee. Oh, yes. Okay, last shots of the day. It's very, very beautiful here. I'll say it again. Why do I live in England? Oh yeah, kids. So we're just gonna ride some beautiful looking gravel roads through these rice fields and shoot a few more photos. And then I think it's a wrap. I am so tired. Never underestimate how tiring it is racing up and down a hill. You have to give it some beams so that it looks good for the camera. So yeah, I've been going from like zero to hero every time I get on the bike, just sort of standing around eating Haribo to then sprinting up a hill. But yeah, it's been fun. It's not the worst day, I suppose. <laughs> Such a nice evening. <laughs> Yay! And much as I love riding here, I am quite happy that it's a wrap. We're all quite tired. <laughs> <laughs> it's sad to leave this beautiful place but there are many more beautiful places to visit. So at least I've been here. Hope you've enjoyed this little glimpse into what it's like on these shoots. Fun, but exhausting. I don't know if I even got the exhausting bit across because when I was so tired, I just kind of stopped filming. Like yesterday in the morning, I was like filming, 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 filming. And then it kind of tails off until eventually I'm kind of forcing myself to even do one clip. But that is a wrap. So I'll see you later. Bye.